Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Belladonna. We're going to open the sarcophagus. Here's Francisca's coffin, but the lid is much too heavy for me to lift. Maybe I could break it open, but I'll need some sort of big hammer or mace for that. Well, that sucks. Another angel. Are you the third sibling? What did you do to get put down here? Is your question. name Gwendolyn? Okay, well, I guess her name is Gwendolyn now. Um, I guess we're gonna exit. Uh, I need to find something that I can use, like a big hammer or something. I need to find that. Can I reach the brain in the jar? The body of a deranged murderer, the decomposed head of an old lady, the brain of a small child. Yeah, that How should could go this well. possibly go wrong? Okay, so I have a brain now. I have the brain of Lucas. Uh, I need something heavy. Is there a hammer in here by any chance? The toolbox is empty. Well, damn. Um. Huh. I still have a bone saw. Hmm. I still have a bone saw. And I still have a screwdriver. I haven't used the bone saw yet. Which makes me think that maybe there is something I have yet to do that I'm supposed to do. Um, so let's exit. Uh, what haven't I done yet? I could smash- The name on the plaque is Lucas von Trauerschloss. I mean, I could smash this it. must be the act. Let's see what happens if I try to smash it. Interesting, but no. Alright, well, interesting, but no. That's what I get. So, exit. Uh, let's go to the living room, because we- We went everywhere else. There's gotta be something that we're missing. Living room. Not not there. Living room. Uh, sheeted furniture. This room looks completely abandoned. Okay, well it doesn't look like I there's anything here. There's a window. It's snowing outside. I have no concept of the current year, season, or even geographical location. Uh, let's see. Sheeted furniture. Drops of blood on the ground. Sheeted furniture to the hall. <clears throat> so we're looking for something that I can use. Let's go to the backyard. Maybe we can find shovel or some stupid thing that I just didn't see before. Because I'm looking, but I'm not seeing anything. Oh, there's a shovel. There's a shovel. Can I... I can't... There's, there's a shovel right here, but I can't take it. That's weird that she's doing that. The stone is so old. What? What? Okay, she's not gonna say anything anymore. Okay, there is a shovel there, but I don't think that she can do anything with it. Uh, let's go to the greenhouse. Maybe there's something here that I missed. Uh, basket. Boxes. Plant. Can I use the bone saw on the big that tree? That won't work. Okay, well, I mean, that was worth a shot. Big tree, there's a potted plant, there's a pot. An ordinary pot with some dirt in it. Isn't this a perfectly sufficient tool for creating beautiful life? That's a good point. Okay. Um, all right. I must be missing something. I have to be missing something. I don't know what, but I'm missing something. I can't get the shovel. I thought maybe the shovel was the answer, but I am wrong beyond wrong. Oh, with the shovel. Um, let's go back inside, I guess. Um, let's go to the study. Um, we gotta figure out what we're supposed to do. Because I can't, uh... There's a dead cat. Okay, proceed through there. Because there's nothing in here that I can grab. I'm, I, I've looked through most of these rooms very, very much. Can I go past her? Is there a way I can go past her? Anything more this way? At least the view is nice from up here. 
All right, let's let's ask her a question because I have no idea where I'm supposed to you find still? something. Um, Some things have been puzzling me. Um, clockwork. Yes, we need something to supply the body with the force to move. Salvaging old time. I, I mean, I thinking. understand what we're supposed to do here. I'll start looking. Thank you. But I I need to find something. The mirror is completely shattered. I think someone in here didn't really like the reflection. Huh. That's a big ward. Well, I am very confused. Uh. There you go, Belladonna. Here's the brain of your dead. Yes, dear. Ah. Okay. I'll start looking for the object. <sighs> Thank you. I Don't talk to me. If I can't think of anywhere to go, uh, cause, I mean, bleh, I've been everywhere in this place, unless there's like some sort of secret place that I've never seen before, uh, and I gotta, I guess I gotta look at everything all over again? Not again, not again. Let's look at the ladder again. Thaw the milk, grind the leaves, poison. Can I bone saw the ladder? I need something else. Okay, well, that's just... Fine and dandy. So I, I can't like I can't I need something else. I can't bone saw the candlestick, which is I hate it. I hate it so much. Let's look at the portrait. Another portrait. Okay, well that's not gonna help me out. How about bookshelves? That's a lot of books. That's a lot of books. Imagine Okay, uh globe. Look, a perfect Uh can I bone saw? I need something else. Can I hit it with a candlestick? I don't know why I thought. Uh, can I screwdriver it? Nothing happened. I kind of figured. Nope. I I cut her off. I didn't mean to. Okay. Well. Okay. Well, this is confusing. Confusing. All right. Let's head on in here again. I gotta figure out a way to break through some of this stuff. Uh, there is a candlestick here. Can I take the other one? A big and heavy candlestick. It looks like there used to be two of them. It's warm. Um, well, damn it. Uh, the, okay, well, the bait. Uh, This is very confusing. Excuse me. Um, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm supposed to take the giant sword from the from the body of armor. No, doesn't look like I can. I can't tell if my reflection in the glass is too distorted, or if I really look like this. Am I even a human being? Uh, can I hit it with a camera? Interesting, but no. Alright. I need something else. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That is one ugly gargoyle. Looks like a George to me. Alright, well, George the gargoyle. I'm kind of looking through, but I'm not seeing anything. Now that is I not the time. Do. Uh, Galvanic Experiment. Iron Maiden. You look so lonely, my friend. I'll call you Eva. Alright, well, that's Eva. Man, I can't think of... Books. A lot of natural philosophy and chem... Huh. My very first memory is waking up on this thing. Before that... Now is not the time. Okay, well, I mean, now is not the time. That is true. Um, the, the big question is, is where do I get the rest of the stuff that I need? Because there's a lot of stuff, and I need something, like, the big stick is gone, uh, with the, so, I mean, there was that, but for some reason I didn't keep it, and I'll never understand that. Alright, so I've kind of gone everywhere, I just don't know what I'm supposed to pick up. And it's kind of puzzling to me, and it's starting to make me go, hmm. Uh, 
I can't put the candlestick back where the other candlestick was. Oh, 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 oh. Go back, go back, go back. Missing candlestick. Uh, maybe I could... Can I put the... No, put the... Put that Nothing back. happens. Okay, well... I don't know why I thought... Okay, well, I thought maybe that was a... Hmm. Hmm. Anger. Uh... All right. Is there something on the body that I missed? That's the only thing I really haven't checked. Uh, hand, wound, blood, body. Don't you worry, little pile of flesh and bones. All right. Um, those are a lot of gargoyles. Lupold, Brunhilde, Arthur, Maya, Lena, Ismuldor, Ether, and Yosef. In that order. Alright. Um, that's fantastic. I see a lot of mechanical. Let's try to screwdriver. This faithful screwdriver will do oh! the trick. What? Time to turn this old clock into a slightly peculiar wardrobe. Alright, okay, so I have the clockwork. And I have... It's my peculiar wardrobe. I have the clockwork, and I have um, the brain. I now need something heavy. I, it can't be the it can't be the candlestick. It just can't be. If it is the candlestick, my brain's gonna explode. I'm going to die, and my whole existence will be called into question. Now, did I try to use the candlestick? I can't even remember. I can't even remember now. But I mean, it's the only big thing that I've got, and you can't, and there's nothing else to really pick up unless I've completely missed something. Which, I mean, could quite possibly be the case. Alright, let's try to go to the secret entrance again. Let's go over to the sarcophagus. Uh, let's use the candlestick on the sarcophagus. The things one does for love. Well, I'll be damned. You look very peaceful, but I do so need your head. And this would be where... How shall I remove it? Then that would be where the bone saw comes in. Now to carefully remove the head. It's remarkably well preserved. Alrighty, I got a severed head, a clockwork, and a brain. That's all I needed. Now I can leave, and... Ooh, she's already moved the body. I can already tell. All right, let's continue our crazy experiment. This can't go wrong completely and totally. All right, severed head. I'll let Belladonna handle that. All right, well then, severed head, Belladonna. Thank you, dear. And clockwork, Belladonna. Thank you, dear. And brain, Belladonna. Thank you, dear. The creation is complete. All we need to do now is force life into these dead limbs. That big switch on the wall initiates the procedure. Will you have the honor, my dear? Oh, of course. Gladly. Let's go over... Actually, can we talk to Bones about the head? Okay, well anyway. Looks like we're pulling time the switch. come. I've wanted to pull this thing since the first time I saw it. Alright, we pulled the switch. And what will happen now to the body? It looks like we're going to resurrect another corpse. But like she said, this is probably a bad idea due to the just striking fact that we're putting the dead body of a child into the brain of a woman's head in a man's body. That's the end? What? Okay, so I guess that starts her army of the undead. That's actually kind of a really wicked looking ending screen there. Um, that is disturbing sounds too. Anyway, we uh, that was obviously uh, that was awesome. That was just epically awesome. I want to thank the people who created the game for uh, allowing me to play their game. Uh, but that was Belladonna. That was a complete playthrough of Belladonna. Once again, I am Vlog. Remember to hit that like button, comment, and of course subscribe. If you want to check out the game for yourself, check it out in the description below. I will see you guys in the next one. Goodbye, everybody.
Thank you very much for watching that video. Click in the upper left to subscribe and then check out Persona 3. Oh, but this is great! I wished also to become the samurai. Make sure you check us out on Google Plus and Twitter for all the new updates and the videos an hour early. Then check out the pale one. Uh, why? Why are you over there? Also, make sure you click on that Brain and Behavior logo so you can understand what the charity drive we're doing right now is. Thank you, and goodbye!